Curious about which guns people bought in 2022? Well, we walk you through the most sought-after pistols, rifles, and shotguns of 2022. Smith & Wesson M&P 15 Sport 2. It's not a surprise that the Smith & Wesson M&P 15 Sport 2 made the list. This bare-bones 5.56 rifle comes from a named shooter's trust with a price point that makes them very attractive. They may not be fancy, but they work. This AR-15 rifle has gone through a few updates over the years, and a few variants are available. Marketed and branded as the affordable yet high-quality option, Smith & Wesson has succeeded in reaching the civilian and duty world alike. With a typical price of around $800, the M&P 15 Sport catches the attention of a broad audience. Most experienced AR-15 owners will tell you that it's difficult to find a trustworthy platform under $900 or so in today's market. Smith & Wesson might just have the exception here. Basic yet effective hardware and designs are found throughout the M&P 15 Sport. A direct impingement gas system is found in the M&P 15 Sport along with T6 aluminum upper and lower receivers. A chromed bolt carrier, gas key, and firing pin provide efficient functionality. As expected, a telescoping buttstock is included for user adjustment. For an entry-level AR-15, the quality here is undoubtedly high, and the fitment of parts is to mill spec. Customization potential is substantial with aftermarket parts and accessories widely available. GeForce GF2P Pump The GeForce GF2P is a simple, affordable, and dependable pump-action 12-gauge shotgun. The GeForce GF2P has a straightforward layout with controls in all the right places and a shortish barrel at 20 inches. The mix of features with the inclusion of the pistol grip 4-end Picatinny rail and weight of a respectable 7 pounds point it clearly in the direction of home defense or truck gun. Starting from the buttstock and moving forward, you encounter a triangular-shaped plastic cross-bolt safety with a slight red line striped across the hot side. The integrated recoil pad at the end of the stock, it's very soft and supple, absorbing recoil nicely and giving me a little flexibility with finding an optimal length of pull. Despite the less-than-tactile slide, the GF2P is still controllable thanks to a comfortable length of pull, cheek weld, and solid shoulder lockup offered by the pistol grip. The GeForce GF2P is an easy-to-use budget shotgun that's squarely aimed at the home defense market. So if you're in the market for a personal protection-style shotgun that won't break the bank, this is a perfect option. Springfield Hellion Springfield Hellion's design has been tested and refined through military trials and has been adopted by several groups of armed professionals around the globe. Because the core features of the Hellion are the same as the VHS-2, it should prove to be an incredibly reliable and durable rifle, but a few changes have been made to make it better suited for the U.S. market. The Springfield Hellion is a 5.56 by 45 mm rifle with a 16-inch barrel in a package that's only 28 inches long. It uses a short-stroke gas piston system with two settings of adjustment, and it weighs 8 pounds unloaded. Other features include an ambidextrous charging handle and safety, an adjustable stock with a cheek riser and QD sling points on both sides of the rifle stock and handguard. The case ejection system is reversible too making the Hellion a great choice for lefties. As for mounting accessories and optics, the handguard has M-lock slots and a generous amount of Picatinny rail spanning the top portion of the rifle. Flip-up iron sights were integrated into the design as well. While it may be new to us here in the U.S., the Hellion is quickly gaining traction, and I wouldn't be surprised to see it become one of the most popular bullpup rifles on the market. Glock 43X it's no surprise to anyone that the best-selling gun on the planet right now is the Glock 43X. The Glock 43X is the answer for shooters who want a top-shelf carry gun, but also want to shoot with precision at 50 yards. The Glock 43X has the same height as the Glock 19 Gen 5, but that's pretty much where the comparison stops. Glock built the G19 and the G43X at the same height because they want both the guns to be easily concealed. It only weighs 1.44 pounds loaded and features a light 5.4 pound trigger pull weight. The G43X is part of the new Slimline series from Glock that provides the same reliability, dependability, and performance 
as standard Glock frames, but a thinner slide and pistol grip. If you're looking for the best carry handgun to break in a new shooter, or to get a modern striker fired 9mm with a respectable capacity and reliable accuracy, the G43X is a great option. Smith & Wesson M&P 12 The Smith & Wesson M&P 12 is a bullpup style pump action shotgun with a futuristic look. The pump action 12 gauge boasts dual magazine tubes, providing a total capacity of 14 plus 1 when loaded with two 3 quarter inch shells. The M&P 12 does feature a 3 inch chamber, However, it can also be loaded with 12 plus 1 3-inch shells for those who value power over capacity. The M&P 12 also sports two pistol grips for better control, one rear and one forward on the pump, and both are modeled after the M&P pistol series, which include the ability to swap back straps according to user preference. The total package is 27.8 inches long and weighs just over 8 pounds unloaded. Unlike some of the other listed models, however, the M&P 12 sports fully ambidextrous AR-15 style controls and its muzzle is compatible with rem chokes. Other features on the M&P 12 include a loaded chamber indicator, Picatinny rail for optics, m loke for mounting accessories, and a push-button assisted loading-unloading system. That being said, the complex loading process means that you'll never want to top off in the middle of a defensive scenario so hopefully the shotgun's generous 15-pound potential capacity proves large enough to get you through the fight. Ruger AR-556 MPR Like the Smith & Wesson M&P 15, the Ruger AR-556 MPR offers shooters an affordable bare-bones AR-15. The AR-556 MPR comes with or without various features, including optics-ready compatibility, an M-lock handguard, a collapsible stock, and all the little features you could ever want. The 18-inch barrel is cold hammer forged 4140 chrome molly steel with a nitride finish for corrosion resistance. Instead of an A2 style flash hider, the barrel on the MPR is tipped with a radially ported muzzle brake of Ruger's own design. Both stock and grip provide good looks and functionality without adding any extra weight. In fact, at 6.8 pounds, the AR556 MPR is only a third of a pound heavier than the original AR-556, and that weight difference is mostly the result of the MPR's longer barrel. This rifle performs impeccably at the shooting range. First of all, it's straightforward and easy to get used to. The flip-up rear side is adjustable for windage, and the front post is also adjustable, but for elevation. Without making any adjustments, this rifle performs admirably, but for those of you that want to stretch your shooting distance, Pairing this rifle with quality electronic optics will increase the precision of your aim. Overall, the Ruger AR-556 is an excellent AR-15 for the money.